Earth's um, inability to uh, sustain our current level of um, lifestyle. Um, do you think that there would be some sort of political intervention where only a, some people would be able to utilize that life extension? Or do you think that this um, would be everybody, as soon as you have that information, you publish it, and then it becomes a well-known practice thing that everybody can now facilitate? Yeah, so that's that's a really concerning question for me. Uh, would the entire population have an access for these longevity, I guess, drugs? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think first and foremost, I think that, you know, people that can afford themselves and more, I get rich or rich the people will have access for those drugs if they will be developed. And this is something that is very concerning because it's, again, showing or, I guess, uh, getting, getting us in, in a way that, uh, you know, the rich people are, have access for a lot of stuff and the poor people uh, are not. And it's, it's a major problem for me, major ethical problem for me. Mm. Uh, would it be, w- would we be able to, you know, deliver that to the entire population? I guess it's, it's a matter of governments and a matter of countries to, to embark on that and to be able to deliver that exactly like they, some of the, those countries are delivering uh, free drugs for uh, for heart disease and for, for, for diabetes and other chronic diseases. Mm. So that's, that's a really good question. And I hope so. I hope so. I hope that everyone, if someone has, you know, there'll be an opportunity for everyone to have uh, access for this science and for these drugs. 